They might be the worst letters in the alphabet for former football players, CTE. Researchers have much to learn about it, but health officials link it to prior concussions. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. A CTE can cause extreme changes in behavior, but researchers can only detect it after a person dies. A family of a man shot and killed by West Des Moines police two years ago believed that he had it, but they only recently found out that their suspicions were true. Taj Simmons talks with the family today and be advised this next story contains multiple mentions of self-harm. Marine Corps Marathon, here's his Iron Man, here's Boston. Kelly Trentley keeps her brother Scott Heisler's running medals and his Marine portrait close by, reminders of when he looked like the picture of health. But while Heisler's body was in shape, his brain was slowly deteriorating. They're not themselves anymore. Uh, the person that you once knew, who you thought you knew, you know, they, their personality just completely changes. Those changes included extreme mood swings and an attempt on his own life in 2020. Heisler grew up playing football and his sister realized concussions and the brain disease CTE might be the reason for his behavior. My parents brought up CTE in 2016 and I blew it off and I was just, you know, kind of almost rolled my eyes and was like, come on, he hasn't played football in 20 years. But in September 2020, just days after his suicide attempt, Heisler was shot and killed by West Des Moines police. Heister held up a pellet gun to officers. His family believes he died of suicide by cop. He knew exactly what they would do. Um, so he essentially left you a suicide note before. He time. did, yeah. He left me a voicemail, yeah, minutes before. Immediately after his death, Heister's family sent his brain to Boston so scientists could test it for CTE. After a year long wait, their fears were confirmed. Heister had CTE, and his sister thinks he may have known it before he died. Twice he voiced to me that he knew there was something wrong with his head. Uh, and so how long did he feel that way? That's what I think about. Heister made a name for himself by finishing marathons, but his family is now racing to publicize the signs of brain trauma before a mental health crisis takes another life. If they've had concussions, you know, um, are they depressed? Are they agitated? Are they are the addiction? All the things that are symptoms of the different stages of CTE, Scott was textbook. In Urbandale, I'm Taj Simmons. Doctors say other symptoms of possible CTE include forgetfulness, anger issues, and being reckless with money. If you or a loved one suffers from CTE or any brain trauma and feel vulnerable, you can call the National Suicide Prevention Hotline, which is now 988.